Yeah, yeah, what it do, what it do, man? Young Zaynus motherfucker. <clears throat> Zaynus clean as NBA 2K16. What a fuck you dig? Just chillin' us right now. Get back to it. Alright, go on. Oh my god, dog. That is some bullshit, nigga. Swear to God. That was supposed to compete for titles. And since the move to Brooklyn, they have had trouble going deep in the playoffs. There's a screen by Robinson. Just five to shoot. Sims. Terrific design on the pick play. And he lays it in. The second he got around the pick and shook his man, it was straight to the bucket for the easy deuce. Very, very well done. And they can just dribble the ball until the buzzer. Yeah, exactly. They got to be happy with the outcome here. Elated, you're right. Free throw line jump shot. A tad short, but it's good off the front iron. Just look at how quickly the lead has grown here over the last few possessions. Clear case here, partner, of saving their best for 15 last. points? Yeah, oh, yeah. So it's the Suns winning easily here. This one was over well before the final. I wasn't even playing a lot either, man. Something to get excited about, Greg, but they never got it. And they sure didn't. I mean, they just rolled to this win. They made it look really easy. What an efficient performance at both ends. And that'll do it, folks. For Greg Anthony, Doris Burke, Clark Kellogg, and the rest of our terrific 2K Sports crew, this is Kevin Harlan saying thanks for watching. And as the fans file out of the building, now time to head over to Ernie Johnson, Shaquille O'Neal, and Kenny the Jet Smith for the post game show. The 2K Sports post game show. Kevin, much appreciated, and now let's present our Jordan player of the game, Eric Bledsoe. They were riding a two-game losing streak coming to this game and could not afford to drop three more. He rolled to the occasion for them tonight, big time. They needed this sort of performance from him. He took his game up a few notches. Love it, Ernie. I can't say enough about the contribution he made defensively. Specifically, his on-ball defense was outstanding. He blew up a lot of plays by getting his hand in there and coming away with a steal. And that aggressive D of his helped guide them to this win. And that'll do it for our broadcast tonight. Hope you enjoyed the show. Uh, for me and, and Kenny Smith, and Shaquille O'Neal, and Kevin Harlan, and the entire 2K Sports crew, have a wonderful evening.
Eight points, nigga. I got 15 points and four rebounds, bruh. Some bullshit, nigga. Real talk. 15 points, four rebounds, nigga. And that motherfucker only got eight points and two rebounds. That is some bullshit, nigga. The only color I care about is green. Money. Now, you've certainly made some money so far, Freak, but it's time we make more money. I'm talking movies, TVs, endorsements, even your own brand Jordan sneakers. I care about the game first, Dom. All that sounds great, but don't you think it's a little too early to be talking about all that? Too early? LeBron was 12 years old in sixth grade when he was thinking Space Jam. It's never too early to take and make leaps. I guess. You guess? This isn't high school. This isn't college. This is the real world. And the real world is fueled by one thing. Oh, money. That's right. Money. Dollar bills, y'all. Why do you think they put presidents on them? Because that's what presides over us. I ever tell you guys about the first dollar I ever made? No, Don, but you're about to. Yo, check this out. CC, this is a great story, right? So I'm seven years old, Queens, New York, 1973. My older brother Lonzo, he's got a lemonade stand. So that's summer, I'm like, Lonzo, you know, let me help out. Let me make a couple of bucks with you. He's like, all right, Dom, come on. I'll teach you the business. So I'm pouring tons of sugar. I'm squeezing the lemons. I got the lemonade stand all set up. I'm like, yo, I got this, right? So I'm watching during the course of the day. I'm noticing something Lonzo's doing. He's not charging for refills. That summer, I convinced Lonzo, no more free refills, and we make $2,000 plus tips. Today, Lonzo's Lemonade is a national brand and publicly traded. Oh, wow. That's dope. I'm not here to impress. I'm here to improve and to assist. I'm like the Italian-American Magic Johnson, running point for Team Freak. <clears throat> no, 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 no. <laughs> the only person running point around here will be me. CC. <laughs> Look at my watch. What do you see? Not this again. I've seen the movie. This is diamonds and platinum. Gold, forget about it. Silver, forget about it. This is diamonds and platinum. It's power and speed, freak. This is what you have. You are on your way to being the biggest thing in the NBA. I'm proposing now that we dominate off the court as well as on. I can't believe I'm saying this, freak, but Dom has a point. You've been establishing yourself on the court, and now it's time to take it off the court. Brand Jordan sneakers, I mean, the possibilities are endless. Listen, Freak, you're going to have to decide the legacy you want to leave. But I'm not some agent from the Yellow Pages. I'm Dom Pagnotti. I'm the man, the myth, the legend, <laughs> the king number one. I'm the best. And I'm a shark. And the Pagnotti shark is working for you. Now, we got to set new goals and bigger goals, okay? I'm talking all-star game. I'm talking dunk contest. When was the last time you saw an NBA great in a dunk contest, huh? I'm talking first team all NBA, first team all defensive team. Well, what about social media? Yvette, great idea. Social media, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram. Let's kick it up a notch. www.freakinginviving.com. That's right, your own website. I've already set it up for you, and it's running great. Wait, hold okay. up. Listen, I'm in negotiations right now on a feature that will allow viewers to watch Freak and only him and his plays during the game. Yeah, but you set up a website without consulting me? Yeah. When did this happen? Last week. Uh-oh. Oh, this is going to be epic. CC. I love you, but I got no time to waste, and you're out there busy doing whatever it is you're doing. Whatever I'm doing? You know what? I'm really sick and tired of the disrespect. This is Team Freak, not the Dom Pagnotti I Italian American Opera. Cece, calm down, all right? Dom here, he's just trying to take us to the next level. Look, Ming Ching, I don't even know why you're here. Your job is to look good and shut. Cece, oh. No, I'm done chilling. Between your clown agent and your gold digging girlfriend, I've had enough. Gold digger? You're the winner of the Lucky Sperm Contest, and I'll have you know I am currently starting my own fashion line. I've already got model contracts from Beijing to Milan, not to mention I graduated top of my class. Summa cum laude. You mean thank you, laude? I don't need a man to save me or provide for me, okay? I got my own, boo. Mm, okay, well, if that's the case, then why has all your success and fame coincided with your relationship with my brother? I mean, if you're really on top of your game, wouldn't that have happened before y'all even met? Right? You know, Jesse, you're just jealous. It's okay, though. Why don't you just play the background, yeah? Enjoy the ride. Y'all both done yet? May I continue? Now, listen, as far as movie properties go, I've already got a script based upon a story of your life, Freak, okay? So, guys, check out these possible titles. Freaking and Vibin', Life and Times, Volume 1. The Freak Chronicle. Freak, the Fast and Furious, Part 1 does it. And this one's my favorite freak. You're going to love this. He got Pagnotti. <laughs> oh, okay. You love All it, right? right? Dom, 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 Dom. Yeah, but look, you're the man, but you're not the man. Okay, you work for me. You have to follow my lead. 
I'm all for your ideas, but in due time. As for now, I want to focus on the court, and we'll discuss some of your ideas at a later date, understood? Yeah, we're calling the gang, bro. That's all you got to say. All right, good. Thank you. Vet, chill. You cannot let Cece get underneath your skin. But on the same token, you cannot go out of your way to piss her off. I don't have time to be playing peacekeeper between you two. You know what? We need to talk about this afterwards alone. Fine. Cece? Cece? You need to hold this together. You and I both agreed long ago that Don was the best agent for me. He has delivered. Are his methods questionable? Is he a shark? Yes and yes. But he is our shark. He's what's best for me, which means he is what's best for all of us. Your job is to bring us balance. Manage the team, sis. We all need to be on the same page. You're right. But blood is thicker than water. You know, I ain't trying to hear all that. I'm not here to hold hands. I'm here to win games and achieve greatness on and off the court. But in order for that to happen, I need everybody, everybody to be on point. Essentially, get right or get gone. Yeah, I don't have time to be teaching you guys how to work together. It either starts now or I find it elsewhere. Squashed? Squashed. Zucchini. Mr. Dom Pagnotti, uh, the diamond and platinum himself. It's a love-hate relationship. What are you thinking about people who see your brother as just a meal ticket? <laughs> well, that's why I'm there. I'm the gatekeeper. Yep. I, I can smell it from a mile away. When you take time out for your own personal life, do you have a personal life? I do. Where at? I just... I think Freak is your personal life. You can think whatever you want, mister, but um, I have a personal life, thanks. Yeah? <laughs> yeah. I think that should end the interview right now. Yeah? It's great meeting you. Drama, man. Spike Lee did his thing in this motherfucker. Yeah, yeah, young Dre in this motherfucker, man. Yeah, yeah, Young Jay signing off, gone.